in their beat.
If I had, you'd be begging me to kill you. This place stinks of rotting corpses. Get ready. Grab what we need and get out of here. chests those are. I wonder what was inside.
Right, Geralt. Looks like it's all over. Thanks for your help, Zoltan. Say nothing of it. Enough yapping. Time for some vodka. First, I want to see if my fuck date's still waiting. Just don't strain yourself. It takes energy to drink with us too, you know. Look, another one. You let one human in and in no time you've got a swarm. Like ants they are. I heard human women need a Good thing you're here, Geralt. A rhyme for wonder? I'm no poet. I know, but you have good ideas sometimes. Yonder? Good! Writing a sonnet for your new muse? Better than that. I'm composing an anthem for Vergen. Want to hear the first version? No. Listen. May those who dream of freedom arise, seeing the sight of liberty with their eyes. Let us go together, become our brother. The choice is yours, you know there's no other. How far shall we venture in this great wonder? Elf, dwarf, and human set forth together yonder. Like it? It rhymes, kind of. All right then, tell me what you discovered. Is it my imagination, or have you become a propaganda mouthpiece for the court? You know what I really like about this place? There is no court. People are with Saskia because they want to be, not because they have to or should be. You have a tendency to go from one extreme to the other. And you have a tendency to shit on every ideal, even the most noble. I try to take an objective view of the world. Yet you've joined us. You have, haven't you? I'm on Vergen's side, at this time don't want to commit, eh? Well, Vergen isn't some whore you can just screw and forget. You're right. Once you're on a teetering bridge, you might as well cross it. Finally, spoken like a man. Oh, sorry, that was racist. Wise words, Witcher. Your orbit seems to have changed. Everyone changes here. Except you, of course. I'm not sure I like changes of that kind. I find them hard to believe. You're an idiot. Saskia is giving Yorvith a chance. If he uses it well, he'll finally be able to emerge from that hole in the ground he's been living in for years. That's the least of it. If he plays his cards right, he can win everyone's respect. People only remember what they want to remember. I suppose you're right. A free state in the Pontar Valley could turn Yorvith from a brigand into a knight. Which is why it's useless to wonder why he's changed. I wouldn't trust him with my child. But who knows what he'll become? My memories and feelings seem inextricably linked. I seem to be recovering both. I believe Yennefer's alive, and I'll eventually find her. Triss? Yennefer? That's some life you lead, my friend. First off, we have no idea if Yennefer's still alive. Second, we have no idea if Triss is alive. Hmm, true. You seem to have two women, when in fact, you don't even have one. Their kind doesn't die easily. I believe I'll find Triss, alive. And Yennefer? I won't know what to do about her until I see her. My memory's coming back. It's just bits and pieces so far, but I can feel them coming together, forming a whole. What have you remembered? The voyage, an endless trek south. I was following Yennefer and the wild hunt. I have no idea how long. It got cold. Only old people were left in the villages I passed through, but they all refused to tell me what had happened to the young, to their children. I finally pressed a man for information. He blamed it on wolf packs, on an outburst of drowners and rot fiends. No one mentioned the wild hunt. Did you catch up to the hunt? I don't know. Got anything you can follow? I'm looking. 
You once mentioned some elven poems about the hunt. I believe I said they could exist, and they'd be old. I don't know any, but look around. You're pretty good at finding things. One thing's for sure, Letho's not on this side of the fog. If you wanted to pursue the assassin, you should have gone to Hensel's camp with Roach. Just because I went after Triss doesn't mean I've forgotten about Letho. Why do you care so much? It's not your coop or your chickens. Letho knows a lot about me. There are certain things that probably only he can explain. I'm not so sure you want to know them. We'll see. Let's say you catch him. What then? I'll decide once I've heard him out, learned the truth. Maybe I'll see his point, or maybe I'll just cut off his head. Geralt! First throat of the Witcher's Guild. Finally, a drink with someone worth talking to. Short on company? What can Yarpin tell me? I prefer listening to horses fart. Any idea where I can play dice around here? Try the blacksmith's helper. I wanted to talk to you about the free state of Vergen. We haven't had the occasion somehow. True. Do you buy into Saskia's ideals? Are you asking me if I believe what she says, or if I believe she'll be successful? Both. Saskia's no liar, that's a fact. But whether we'll manage, who can tell? One thing is sure, we'll never know if we never try. For now, a great battle awaits. A battle in which elf, dwarf, and human will stand side by side. And that is beautiful in itself. It's also the biggest potential weakness. Nothing unites folk like sheer death. I believe those who survive will honor the deaths of their comrades. If they win. Even if they don't. News spreads fast. Others will follow in our footsteps. The Kingslayer's trail has gone cold. Have you heard anything? No one could sneak into Bergen. We watch day and night. Anyway, who would they come for here? Stennis? Why so keen on capturing the Assassin of Kings? Letho knows a lot about me. Certain things maybe only he can explain. Is it worth sticking your neck out to know what was in your head before? Yeah, I'd say it's worth it. Yorvith seems to have changed. Have you noticed? Oh, has his ass grown fatter in Saskia's keep? An elf who was the greatest foe of humans will now fight for their freedom. Doesn't that surprise you? Only harpies don't change their minds. I'm no expert on elves, but as I see it, he's got a stiffy for Saskia. Yorvith? He stood all gentle as a lamb in council, stealing glances at her tits. When she spoke to him, he looked as happy as a fool whittling a wooden toy. Bergen seems like an ancient town. Do you know its history? It's one of the mining colonies Mahakam established. There were lots of them just 500 years ago. Now they're mostly in ruins. It was the first town where dwarves and humans began working side by side. For the past three years, it's been a symbol of our common death. Peasants now refuse to shovel them in the air. Oh. They dream of Who's this, my failing eyes spy? Geralt of Rivia visiting old Yarpen Zegrin. Getting anywhere with the new recruits? Like whores in a brothel. They're plowing away at full speed. 
Sarsky's army's full of men better at holding their pricks than a weapon. The Zoltan and I are helping them catch up. Most importantly, they don't lack spirit. They won't defeat Hansel's regulars with zeal alone. Ah, uh, we'll show you what an army facing either victory or death is capable of. For we've no other choice, Geralt. I've been trying to figure out what Philippa Eilhart's doing in all this mess. The same thing as always. Conspiring until she gets her pubes in a knot. I know you hate sorceresses, but try to put your animosity aside. We hate them, as a fact. But why do you think that is? It's not because of their secret knowledge of their nice tits. Their hearts are full of dumb guilt. Mark my words. You exaggerate. No, maybe not all of them. But Isle Heart's the worst. Need I remind you how she peddled her ass to Dijkstra just to learn the plans of the Redanian Intelligence Service? Everyone in Vergen knows she's not into cock. I tell you this, it's her ilk that caused the ruckus on Thanid Island. Think she's any different here? I'm crap at talking, girl, but you do all right. So I'd appreciate, as soon as Saski is better, slip a word in her ear to watch out for Philippa. Were you in Rivia when I got caught on that pitchfork? Was I? Fuck, Wolf, I saw you die! I didn't see the little bastard who took you for a haystack, but I swear it looked like you weren't going to make it. So I'm well glad you managed to lick your wounds. I don't know if it taught me anything. Come on, I had to. Not many have survived their own death. You haven't noticed that I'm pissing at wind again, fighting for a cause that isn't mine? No, I haven't. A free operator is in the interests of any decent fellow. Did you fight at Brenner? Oh, fuck. I know you've got amnesia, but you could have remembered that. Ah, oh, it was a beautiful day. On one side, six and forty thousand black ones. On the other, us, the Nordlings together. The Redanians led by De Reuter on the left, the Temerian regiments in the middle, and us on the right. The Mahakam Volunteer Army, all dwarfs. Even the likes of Kohor must have shit his britches at the sight of us. He hardly lacked courage as I heard it. All right, brave bastard, that's true. Prefer to die than run like a rat. I don't believe I've ever seen a bigger melee. Except maybe three years ago here at Vergen. Would have managed that day too, even without the magic. That burning shit that fell through the sky. Why, even the Dun Banner knelt before us when we brought our battle axes down. Some say not one of the Dun Banner survived. Any truth to that? Biggerhorn nabbed the survivors as they fled south. But most men of the Banner lie in the catacombs, along with a standard. The Dun Banner. What the hell kind of name is that for a unit anyway? It's as if they couldn't get their fucking flag clean. Zoltan claims you can arm wrestle like no one else. He's right. Did he tell you I beat him? Omitted that bit somehow. Oh, fuck. Want to wrestle me? I'm ready for your challenge always. So? Show me what you got. That witcher, who's he? He travels the lands, killing monsters for coin. Why's he got those glistening eyes? Sorcerers mutated him when he was young. <laughs> That's some training you received at Care Morhen. You're no wimp yourself. That's a man whose He's business is not ruined by war. Change the fate of... How are you, Sheldon? Better than at Brenner. Though we've quite a rumble ahead of us. But I promise you this. We'll kick Hensel's arse and send him scurrying back to Kedwin. Zoltan says your company are true arm-wrestling masters. Unbeatable, last I recall. Is that so? Care to check if that's still true? Sounds good. Ready to take me on. Give me your best shot. Very true. Sets my teeth on edge.
Look, another one. Sure there's no dwarf and blood in your family? I'll tell you when I get my memory back. Like ants they are. I heard human women need only sit astride a man's pants for their bellies to puff up. Mine's safe again. Any plans to do something with it? Of course. Soon as the battle's done, we'll resume digging. Shame to let those rich deposits go to waste. My uncle says they'll put Vergen right back in its feet. Zoltan's talking about a shared enterprise or some such. He's to manage operations with my uncle as general overseer. We just got to save the town first. I'm looking for places near Vergen where magic would be strong. Somewhere a sorcerer might have stayed? Let me think. Verfran, a summoner of elementals, once lived in the wood beyond Vergen. They say his creatures excavated the entire southern wall. You could also search the nearby ruins and abandoned crypts. If boulders with arms and legs aren't magic, then I don't know what is. Hey, Scalen, wanna arm wrestle? I really like to wrestle, but, uh... Show me what you're made of. All right. Wanna take me on? Show me what you're made of. I believe I'd split a rock with my dick sooner than I'd beat your arm wrestling. I guess that makes me the new champion of Vergen. No shame in losing to the White Wolf. Though there's one who could still be a match for you. Who? The mighty Numa. I wrestled him in Kovir. Couldn't move my arm for the next week. They say he don't play fair. But that's just losers talking. You ever wrestle him? Give him my regards. I will. We killed most of the necrophages. Most? The passage to the lower level collapsed. They won't get out. In time, they'll die off and you can restart work. Thank you, Witcher. The whole of Vergen thanks you. Here's your coin. Shive, Skags, and Zigrim will get the same. Saskia needs help, Cecil. Philippa can produce an antidote, but she needs a magic artifact to do that. Would you like a fern and a dancing worm to go with it? Listen, I don't know about magic, but there is a place. As long as I can remember, it's been of interest to sorcerers. They say it's a very strong intersection. Look for magic there. Where exactly is there? Seek out the ruins in the forest beyond Bergen. There's a place of power there. You can't miss it. 
Why so glum? Saskia's a tough girl. She'll bounce back. Keep your head up. Thanks, Cecil. No, Witcher. I thank you. Save that lass, and you'll save my town. I'd like to play dice. Shall we? to raise taxes. Here are your winnings. Aren't you gonna ask for a rematch? You're too good. Try Haggard or Smith's Apprentice. I wouldn't mind a closer look at your swords. Care to browse through my wares? I'd like to play dice. Shall we play now? You must be an old hand at this. The prize money is yours. I'd like something besides coin. You're a blacksmith's apprentice. Got anything interesting? Hmm, I suppose I might. What do you fancy? Got any meteorite steel? Aye. Three colors. Blue, yellow, and red. It's meteorite steel. Not bloomers or garter belts. Meteorite steel comes in several varieties depending on the nature of the element it's saturated with and the depth of that saturation. The elements dye the ore different colors. For instance, fire dyes the ore red, and red meteorite, well, you work it differently. You heat and hammer form it differently. You understand now? Mm hmm Sure you're just the blacksmith's helper? Want anything, or are you just going to stand there and wonder? I'll take my coin, please. I wouldn't mind a closer look at your swords.
I wouldn't mind. It's not just any trouble. My pentacles intrigue you? Indeed. I'd like to see them up close. Let's start with introductions then. I'm Felicia Corey, and you're Geralt of Rivia. Why the surprised face? I heard about you in school. Whether you like it or not, you're a hero of contemporary history and of the love stories we read beneath our blankets. You studied at Aratusa? Yes, though I'm still to finish my portion and fetish internship, which is why I'm here. And you're doing it under Philippa Eilhart's watchful eye. Any way I can help you? Help from a hero of our readings? Now that's drawing on sources for real. I'd be grateful. The locals are reluctant to buy magic items, and I really need to pass. Let's see what I can do. I'll say it again. Humans are strange. Let's hear it. Right? Right. You work just for your elves? Not just. 
You don't say much, do you? And they said you're grumpy. To marry, they become terribly picky. Oh, another traveler. From where? Wait, let me guess. Hmm. From Tamaria. Had it at the tip of my tongue. So, what brings you to Bergen? Wait, I know. Business. Just what I thought. And you're. A witcher. Well, well. We don't often see witches here. What do witches do, anyway? We solve problems. Oh. I have a problem with my boyfriend. Did you find his entrails strewn on the porch and his head a few paces away? Because those are the kind of problems I solve. Whether the bride's been ploughed, has a dowry, is diligent. How do you see it? Do the gods favor Lady Saskia, as she claims? The gods never favor rebellions that seek to topple the natural order of things. Admit it. You would rather not see a woman at the head of an army, especially when sorceresses surround her. Even a child knows it. Let's go drink, friends. I'm gonna get as drunk as a lord. Why is that? They stole it. The plowing bird stole it. My dream is gone. And then what's the grin for? Night after night, I dreamed of my dead wife for years. Let's go for some liquor. Drinks on me. Greetings, Batgirl. I'm glad to see you again. Again? Flotsam? The fire? Funny how these things work. I'll never forget that. Oh, unimportant. Needless to say, I'm deeply indebted. Hmm. Sorry. No need to be. But I feel I should pay you back somehow. I've started anew here, you know. That always builds confidence. Sure I can't tempt you with something? Wait a minute. Is this what I think it is? It is if you want it to be. We elves might seem strange by your standards. You saved my life. A bit of joy as recompense is not too much to ask. I'm intrigued. It's been a tough day. I think some joy might do me good. Am I ever glad to have that debt off my mind? I'm happy for you. I'm happy for us both. Oh, I have a memento for you. Take this. A key? Mmm. To an old mine pit. I've no use for it. But you're quite there. All right. Thanks. Thank you. 
Strange. I smell sulfur. Trust the girl. Sassy. No, but I trust you all and he trusts her. Hey! I don't think we'll get through this in one piece. Storm is coming. 